and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're here for the first time, my name is Anne. And if you have been here already, welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to show you a very easy five minute eye makeup look, which I used only one eyeshadow for and one liquid eyeshadow on the eyelid. It was super easy, super quick, and I can't wait to show you guys how I did this. So the day before New Year's Eve, I posted a video where I used a liquid eyeshadow from Stila which turned out to be a very beautiful look and it was also really easy. So I decided to order two more colors, which are these two. One of them is called Kitten Karma and the other one is called Smoldering Satin. So for today's video, I'm using this one, Kitten Karma. I applied it all over the eyelid and I have to say I'm just obsessed with these liquid eyeshadows because they are so easy to use. It just looks like you put like a lot of effort on your eyeshadow, even though it's just super easy. So I'm just really obsessed with these eyeshadows. I'm gonna get a few more because I wanna get every color that they have basically. But in today's video, I'm using the shade Kid and Karma. So let's get started. I hope you guys will enjoy today's video. So the first thing I'm going to do is use this eyeshadow primer from MAC Cosmetics, which is the paint pot in the shade Soft Ochre. I'm going to apply this all over my eyelids using a P84 brush from Sigma Beauty and of course apply this on both of my eyelids. For today's video I'm going to use like very minimal product but the palette I'm going to use is the Treasure Chest palette from Barry M Cosmetics and I'm taking this warm brown color. I'm just going to start blending this all over my crease. And this is actually the only shade that I will be using today. It's quite like a sort of medium tone brown. But if you don't apply too much product in one, you can definitely create like a smooth transition. So don't apply too much just in one. Kind of slowly build it up. You can always go back in with more of the eyeshadow to make it look more darker. Then for all over my eyelid, I'm taking this Glitter and Glow Liquid Eyeshadow from Stila in the shade Kitten and Kitten Karma. A lot of you recommended this on Instagram uh, for me to buy, so I went and bought this online and I'm really happy that everyone recommended this because it's such a beautiful color and I'm just obsessed with these Stila liquid, lip liquid lipsticks, what am I saying? The liquid eyeshadows because they are so easy to apply. Like you just apply this all over the eyelid and it just looks like you put so much effort in your eyeshadow and in fact you didn't really put like a lot of effort. Like I only use one shade in my crease then I apply this all over the eyelid and it's already looking quite glamorous. So I'm really loving these liquid eyeshadows just because they're so easy to use and they give so much effect on the eyes. So I will definitely get a few more of them. So then for my eyeliner, I went in with the Maybelline Gel Eyeliner. I'm going to create a simple line above the lash line. And I'm only doing this because I am going in with some fake eyelashes. And I feel like whenever I apply fake eyelashes, I sometimes when you don't apply eyeliner, it doesn't really connect nicely on the eyelid. So I apply a little bit of eyeliner just so that you can't really see the lash band, if that makes sense. So if you are only going in with mascara, you can keep it that way and just leave it like this or you can go in with eyeliner anyway. It will definitely create more of a darker effect along the lash line and I really like that. So now I'm taking that same color from the Treasure Chest palette from Barry M. I'm going to apply this underneath the lower lash line and I'm taking a flat diviner brush from Sigma and then I took a Morphe M506 to blend it all out. And then I also went in with a little bit of um, that eyeliner and I smudged it a little bit underneath the lower lash line. Then I went in with this mascara from MAC Cosmetics and I'm going to apply a little bit on the upper lashes and also for my lower lashes. Now for my fake eyelashes today, I'm going to use these lashes from Bogai Beauty. They are really beautiful and I'm going to apply them using my tweezers. And my favorite lash glue is the House of Lashes lash glue. It will just make your lashes stay in place all day perfectly. And then this is the end of the video. I really hope you all enjoy watching today's video. I know I only showed the part where I did my eyes, but if you want to know like what products I use for my face, I will be posting a short Instagram tutorial where I show like every step I did for my face. So don't forget to add me on Instagram. Also, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you did enjoy. This is really helpful for my YouTube channel. And hopefully I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.